my granddaughter created a presentation for her class in Google Slides. And now we would like to take those slides, turn those into pictures, and add them to Animoto to make a video. So in Google Slides, if I go to File, Download As, I can download each slide as an individual JPEG. But that would actually take too long. So the workaround for this is to download as a Microsoft PowerPoint the whole presentation. So I'm going to go ahead and do that first. So I saved this presentation as a PowerPoint and then um, opened it up in PowerPoint. And when I go to File, I'm sorry, click in there, I can then Save As. And I want to save it as a JPEG file right here and it's going to ask me every slide or the current slide and I want every slide to be saved as a JPEG so it's all been they've all been saved as a separate picture after I downloaded all of those files I found them in my download folder and now I am ready to go into Animoto and I'm going to create a new video And there are different themes, so I'm going to look for something that's not premium. And I'm going to go ahead and pick this one that says Earth, so it kind of fits the theme of her Stearns farm. So I'm going to go ahead and create the video. And I have my very simple Animoto dashboard here. So I'm going to go ahead in the Add Photos videos and I'm going to go Upload Pictures and Video and I have that Stearns Farm on my desktop so you can see all of those files there. I'm just going to go ahead and select all and as you can see all of the pictures dropped in automatically. And if I want to, I can preview my video. There is a song that comes with it. I can change the song. I probably will. I can also add audio. So if I want to record my own audio of Lily talking about each slide, I can do that, and then I can drop that audio file in there. There's also some text here. But because her presentation already has text, I don't think we really need to add a title screen or any kind of ending. So I'm just going to go ahead and preview it see what it looks like. satisfied with that video, I'm going to go ahead and produce it. Um, if I don't like the way the theme looks, I'm going to go ahead and continue editing, which I'm going to do right now. So what I decided to do was change the song, which I just clicked in here and then found a different song. And also, I thought that the I couldn't see the pictures long enough. So when I select a picture, there's a little settings tool on the bottom right. So I click in there and I am able to um, star this picture so it lasts longer. You are seeing my iLeo pop up which comes on my computer to make sure I take breaks. And I can also do some editing of the picture. Or I can rotate or I can trash it. So I can go into every single one of these if I want and do some editing. So I'm just going to make some of the pictures last a little, couple seconds longer so you can focus on those. Also, if I want to, I can add a caption. So when I click in one of these pictures, I can write something here. We had fun. Go ahead and save it. And then this resource page, you probably don't need in here, so I'm just going to go ahead and delete that image. And let's take another look at it. 
So as I said, if I've decided that this is the theme, the song, and all the editing I want, I can go ahead and produce my video. And I can give it the title. Probably at Stern Song. And then I can pick the video quality and go ahead and finish. And you see here that I have some options of where I want to upload this or download it or share it, or embed it, send it in an email, tweet it out. So what I usually do is two things for sure. I always download it so I have my own copy. I usually put that in my Google Drive. And then I also will share via YouTube. And that's it.